reason why I came to the client side was because the best ideas of mine end up in PowerPoint decks on my shelf. Uh, because I couldn't find a client that would actually do them. Uh, so, but, uh, that's, I, I shouldn't say that. But, um, but, but we're, I, I consider myself extremely lucky because our senior leadership is outrageously supportive. I mean, unbelievably supportive. But I think that's because they also realize that it's a transformational opportunity. Instead of looking at it as a potential threat, it's actually a unique opportunity that we might never see again. Uh, and so, you know, that, that's one, one piece. I think the key, though, is, is to continue to show success. So it's not like, and I didn't show some of these slides, you know, that, uh, look, digital has existed inside, and I have the benefit of standing on the shoulders of giants or alongside giants like John Vale, who, you know, built the first Pepsi website and has been there for, you know, so digital was, was there. But I think that one of the keys is, is to continue selling it up. Um, and so, you know, we package stuff up really well. We do small experiments. I didn't show this thing about Twitter, but we did a, a Twitter experiment to show that we could drive as much value as paid media could. Now, that's not to say that it should be one versus the other, but that it was, you know, a, a, a part of the marketing mix. And then we share that far and wide. You know, we share mission control far and wide. So what we try to do is we try to do experiments, prove out success, share those things far and wide. That continues to help drive buy-in. Uh, and, and, and the compass is important because we're highlighting things that are working for other people across the organization and sharing it far and wide. Um, so I just think it's it's really about creating the use case, proving it out, and then it helps you to expand uh, resources, budgets, all the time.